Top 5 Muscular Women in the World, Part 71 Hello guys, I am Keisha, but we will accompany you on a journey to explore the most wonderful things in gymnastics and martial arts. Today's female bodybuilders are those of the most admirable female bodybuilders in the world. Why don't we sit down together and find out more about them? Let's go! Number 5. Lena Headblade The first female bodybuilder I want to tell you is Lena Headblade. Lena was born in 1963 in a middle-sized town called Lindbergh in Oribo County, Sweden. Wow, look at her body. It is so hot and sexy. Her curves are so sharp. It seems that she must be training really hard to get that body shape. In fact, her body's measurements are really impressive. She is 5 feet 5 inches high, and her body is so well proportioned, with her total weight of only 129 pounds. She started her fitness journey with a sport called handball, a big sport in Europe. However, one day, her knee was injured. This stopped her from her future plans in handball, making her move to a gym. By coincidence, she found that her body responded quickly to weightlifting and gained muscles quite fast. Lena's first competition was in 1997 at a regional championship and a qualifier for the Sweden championship. Up to now, her biggest success was at the 2007 Swedish championship. She won the first position in her division and overall. At present, she works as a caretaker for retarded people. Number 4. Eva Mays The woman you are seeing is Eva Mays. Eva Mays was born in the year of 1992. She is young, isn't she? But her body is really attractive with a long time of training. She grew up in the city of Antwerp, Belgium. She works as a CrossFit athlete and a coach in her country. In season, she weighs approximately 133 pounds. Meanwhile, it rises up to 142 pounds during the off-season month. Hey, do you think the same as me? She is so sexy with a well-proportioned body, right? Eva Mays competes mainly in the WBFF Pro. Although Eva has been training in fitness for more than 5 years, she just began to participate in professional shows recently. At that time, her first show was the 2018 World WBFF Pro, where she ranked in top 5. After that, she started to compete in more pro shows. In the WBFF World's Bahamas 2019, she got home 6th place in the division of Pro Diva Fitness Model. Eva is really active on social networks. She has an Instagram account of more than 18.7 thousand followers. There, she shares happy moments with her boyfriend, Maxim Morrison, an IFBB and BBF champion. They always support each other. What a lovely couple. Number 3. Maggie Schepanzik And now, the third female bodybuilder today is Maggie Chapanzik, a professional CrossFit athlete. Maggie is originally from Poland, but has lived in the UK for almost 14 years. She is a full-time student of journalism. That sounds interesting, right? But above all, CrossFit is definitely her biggest hobby, Maggie said. Maggie started CrossFit around 7 years ago and has only been doing it professionally for about 3 years. But you know what? Maggie was once unable to move around her house. About 4 years ago, she tore ligaments and cracked her cartilage in the left knee, causing her to have a knee surgery. Luckily, she has been involved in sports from a teenage, so she could get her strength back pretty quickly. A year later, Maggie was finally able to get back to training properly. Maggie is a really determined and energetic athlete. She always brings positive energy to others. You can find her on Instagram at Maggie Chapanzik. Number 2. Melissa Pirro
Now let's meet Melissa Pirro. Melissa was born on January 17th. She has now been over 50. But wow, her body is still so well proportioned. In terms of her height, she is 5 feet 5 inches tall, and she weighs approximately 135 pounds. Melissa has been very active in sports since she was a child, and for Melissa, modeling and competing are her hobbies, which she truly enjoys. But you know what? When she isn't training for a competition, she works as a software engineer. Unbelievable, right? In 2006, Melissa decided to try competing in the figure division of the NPC. Her attempt was successful, and she quickly climbed through the local and national ranks. Soon thereafter, she earned the IFBB Pro card in just 10 months. In 2008, she took a break. Melissa was about to get back to training in 2014, but she had a spinal fusion surgery. In 2015, Melissa returned to the stage, and only a year later, she was able to get home first place at the IFBB for Rigno Legacy. Number 1. Caitlin The last female bodybuilder today is Caitlyn. She has the full name of Celeste Barrow Bonin. Caitlyn is her ring name in WWE. Caitlyn was born on October 7, 1986 in Houston, Texas, US. She is now the current Slam Force Women's Champion under her real name. Caitlyn is at 5 feet 6 inches. Currently, she weighs approximately 170 pounds. Caitlyn started her career as a body fitness model. In 2007, she won NPC John Sherman Classic Bodybuilding Figure and Fitness Championships. In July 2010, she signed a contract with WWE. Later that year, she competed in and won the all-female third season of NXT. She won the WWE Divas Championship in January 2013 and held the title for five months before retiring in January 2014. She came out of retirement and made a return on the independent circuit in February 2018. Caitlyn has been married PJ Braun on June 20, 2014. However, they divorced three years later. Recently, in April 2021, she announced her engagement with Grand Giac. These five female bodybuilders are wonderful, aren't they? I know there are many other amazing women out there. We will explore them together in the following videos. If you want to know any female bodybuilder, leave your comments below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification bell to watch more interesting videos. And now, goodbye, see you soon.